Welcome back. The 4th of July, all about that red, white, and blue. And this morning, we've got blogger Charlotte Smith here from charlottehouse.com to make some great, simple projects that your yes. kids can help with. Yep. Stay indoors, maybe enjoy some air conditioning. <laughs> I like that. I know. Well, so my deal with the 4th of July is that I love decorating for it, but I actually don't have a lot of red, white, and blue myself, so I can't, like, borrow from my house. Mm. I'm also hesitant to spend a fortune on... 4th of July decorations because then they're just like collecting dust for the year. Right. But I am cool to spend $10 to decorate the whole table, the whole yard, and that's what we have here. I love it. 10 bucks. Yeah. So I'm always looking for inexpensive, unexpected ways to dress a table. So whether it's a tablecloth or a runner or placemats. And these bandanas you can find anywhere, everywhere, the dollar store. They're super inexpensive. I made, I put six of them together here. This would be a really fun tablecloth. Yeah. I actually sewed it, but I fully expected to use a fabric glue or something even lazier. So I love it. You don't need to have a sewing machine to do that. And then here, I love doing this trick at the holidays. These are just bandanas, and you can see I just, I literally tied them around a throw pillow at the corner. And it's just an easy way to give yourself a temporary red, white, and blue throw pillow. And I love how it kind of looks rustic. Yeah, I love just a Just have bandana. a glass of lemonade and hang out on exactly. the bandana and pillow. And they come in other colors, too, so that if you like this idea, but you don't necessarily need them for 4th of July, you can get them for other colors. Because I think so for a summer barbecue, they're super cute. Yes. So these, um, I think if the ice cubes are fancy, people will basically assume that your whole party is really <laughs> fancy. So these are literally ice cubes with blueberries and strawberries frozen inside, red, white, and blue. They're on theme. It's a nice way to decorate your bar. It will make your drinks that much more mm, festive. Yeah. And again, free. Especially, you could put those in, the kids would love them in yeah. lemonade or, like you said, cocktails, Yeah, too. and we always have this sort of fruit lying around in the summer, so again, of course. really inexpensive. So these are, mason jars are so great because they're really inexpensive. You might even have leftover soup jars, soup, um, sort of like pasta sauce jars, mm -hmm. and I just went to the craft store. If you're uncomfortable using one of these flags on the mason jar, you could use a napkin, you could use another piece of fabric, you could use a a ribbon. A piece of bandana, maybe. Yeah, exactly. That would be really, really cute. And then I just use some Mod Podge and I paint it right on. So these could be a place to display silverware. They could be a votive. They could be a vase. So this yeah. is, again, another really quick, easy way to decorate your you table. You said Mod Podge. Is that like a type of glue? It is. Okay. It's a type of glue. It comes in lots of different finishes. It's pretty inexpensive, but you can see it dries clear. So you don't even notice that it's there, but it's, it's on. Hmm. And then last but not least, this is a little bit kitchen. It's a little kind of, it's definitely the 4th of July, but again, it's free. So these are paint stirrers. And if you go to most paint stores, especially if you're buying something, they'll give you a handful. All you need are five. <laughs> I taped off the stripes. I spray painted them. And I fully expected to have to nail the ends, but I actually was able to kind of weave them in and out of each other. So those aren't even, they're just kind of glued. Are they glued? No, they're no. not even. I could pull it right apart, which wow. I won't. But this, I think, is really fun. You could do a couple of these and hang them on your porch. You can hang them from your trees. And again, free. Yes, yes, yeah. inexpensive. <laughs> and these are things that your kids could definitely okay, enjoy. definitely help with. Yeah. I love this. Great yeah, stuff. it's fun. So Thank red, you. white, and blue. It's uh, you have and a couple I, days. I love, I love the, a good pinwheel. It's I know. Nice. Those are at the grocery store. It's everywhere yeah. nowadays. I know. You can. You gotta. You always have to be thinking. I know. That's, and you that's never what, know. That's what Charlotte Smith does. Thank you so much, Charlotte. My pleasure. Great stuff. Uh, for more information, more ideas, head to our website, wtnh.com. Click on the honor tab and pull it down to the Good Morning Connecticut Weekend section.